what could be in this giant package that we got from eBay? Oh, it's just a tiny sword. So we got this package from Hong Kong. This one took forever. It's uh, rated at three dollars and eighty cents for a total value of ten bucks. So um, pretty cool little device. First saw these on a YouTube video a while back, and I'll bet you a lot of people are sick of seeing our videos if I've already posted them all. I know I've filmed a few videos on these. Wow, is that tape strong? So we uh, open it up with that tiny sword, and what do we have? Oh, a little black sack. All right. And inside the little sack. Uh oh, more of these damn magnetic BBs. Yep, magnetic BBs. So uh, they give you four extra in this set, which is great because I've lost way more than four so far out of my other sets. And I'm not seeing how to open this, so I'm going to sort it. it. Turns out this sword is not very sharp at all. Who would have thought? And I'm assuming they're just the same as every other set of magnetic BBs that we've gotten so far, but we'll double check, and sure enough, they're pretty decent. So, another pile of magnetic BBs to throw in the pile. These come from Hong Kong. Uh, they're the cheapest ones so far, just over 12 bucks, and free shipping. But uh, $12, and I probably waited a month for them. That other place I ordered from here in the U.S. were 13 or 14 dollars, and they got here in the same week I ordered them. So uh, these are okay, but unless you're really shopping for the money over time, I check out if they've got any left at that U.S. supplier. So anyway, real fun puzzle, and again, you either like these or you don't. I'm not going to get into them in this video, but uh, just the idea that shopping around I ended up getting them from three different sources here in town for the most money of course shopping around on eBay found them got them pretty quick and then I bought these these were actually the first ones I bought and I'm, these are the last ones I'm receiving so uh, seem to be the same size as all the others Let me just test that real quick here's the first set that I bought the buckyballs here in town and uh, they sure seem to be. Well, they might actually be a different size now that I'm looking at it. What do you think? They do sort of look different to me. So I'll have to get a mic out and test them. So these may actually be a new size, a little bit smaller size than the uh, the buckyballs at least. Which actually the buckyballs are a little bit bigger than the ones I got from the other place on eBay. So these Chinese ripoffs might just be a hair smaller. Not that it makes any difference. They still work with the bigger ones. So if you mix them all together, that's not the biggest thing. But it can be an issue if you're making something, I guess, fairly intricate or fairly, uh, um, you know, that need that would that would be affected by a slight change in size. So anyway, another set of magnetic uh, ball puzzle game toy thing. Fun.